Chocolate and roses is a pretty common gift for Valentine's Day. Maybe the most common for friends, spouses, family members. But what about our four-legged family members? If you watched our video, Seven Common Household Poison Hazards, you'll know that chocolate isn't a really great gift for dogs. And roses are far too prickly to retrieve. Well, today I'm going to teach you how to make organic Valentine's Day cupcakes for your dog. I'm Ken Steep. This is Hippie Shake. And welcome to McCann Dogs. To get us started, you're going to need these seven ingredients. One half cup of rye flour, one teaspoon of baking powder, one third of a cup of organic canola oil, one third of a cup of organic applesauce, one egg, three tablespoons of organic plain Greek yogurt, and one and a half tablespoons of organic peanut butter. And you can also add in two tablespoons of organic honey if you'd like, but remember it does add to the calories. Let's start by preheating our oven to 350 degrees. Next we're going to add our baking powder, uh, our dark rye flour, it's a half a cup, and our canola oil, and we'll mix all these guys up. Now truth be told, I'm really not much of a cook. Uh, when I'm not making videos for you guys or training dogs, I'm, uh, I work as a firefighter uh, for almost 20 years now and if anyone suggested that I were to make my crews uh, any meal, I would probably get laughed out of the room. But when it comes to desserts and baking, uh, that seems to be where my strengths lie. Hippie Shape seems to like it already. Um, and I think that you would have to be a dessert enjoyer to be a good dessert preparer and you can check that box off too. But um, if you are a subscriber already and you've seen any of our videos, uh, you probably have seen Hippie Shake and I do a, an ice cream, an all natural ice cream for your dog. Um, and uh, so it, apparently it's not just people desserts that I like to make, but dog desserts too. So once that's well mixed, let's add our one third cup of organic applesauce. And one egg. and we'll mix that in. So now's the point when you can add your organic honey into the batter. Um, I'm actually going to add some food coloring and food coloring uh, is totally safe for dogs, especially if it's oh, specifically when it's water-based. So choose a water-based food coloring and I'm just going to add a few drops just so that it's got that, uh, that little more Valentine's feel. We try to make it maybe look like a red velvet or something like that. But I'm going to mix that food coloring in and we'll see how that turns out. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Um, I grabbed little Valentine's Day themed um, liners, uh, muffin liners. Uh, I also grabbed a tiny little muffin pan. So uh, this mix will make about six large muffins or cupcakes. Uh, I'm gonna make nine small cupcakes. Again, we'll obviously have to take these uh, the liners off before I give them to the dogs, but I feel better about giving them uh, the dogs the smaller um, cupcakes. We're really careful about how much we feed the dogs. We have uh, all of our dogs, except for a couple of retired ones, are competition dogs. So we're really careful about what we feed them. Um, so we're going to now move to half filling each one of these uh, little cups. You know, we often say uh, around the training facility that uh, in just a few weeks your dog can become a good family member and we really uh, mean that, you know, I, I love being able to do this kind of thing for our dogs because they really are members of our family uh, and, and it's fun for me to do stuff like this for little hippie shake here. Um, I'm going to grab a teaspoon and start filling these about half full. So now that that's ready, let's get these into the oven. Remember 350 degrees for about 10 minutes and we'll check on those in just a, a few minutes. We'll see how they come along. Let's just check these guys with a toothpick. Looks pretty good. 
So while we wait for the cupcakes to cool, it'll take about 10 to 12 minutes for them to cool, um, likely to room temperature. I'm going to start getting our, our icing prepared. So uh, I'm going to add uh, one heaping tablespoon of peanut butter. Now I know the recipe calls for a tablespoon and a half, but uh, our guys really like peanut butter. So I think I'm going to make it um, a little bit uh, extra creamy. But I'm also going to add the three tablespoons of uh, plain Greek yogurt. And you can choose an organic yogurt if you want this to be a truly organic um, recipe. But I'll quickly add these guys in. And I almost forgot our food coloring for that uh, val special Valentine's Day effect of uh, red icing. Now remember it's water-based food coloring and it's not alcohol-based. So I've got to remember to add that to our icing so it's extra red. And in just a couple of moments we're going to be ready to uh, put icing on our cupcakes. So I have swapped out my tablespoons for a couple of teaspoons and uh, it's just a little bit easier to put the icing on that way. We're going to start to put some icing on our cupcakes. Well, I think Hippie Shake has waited long enough. She's been the perfect little assistant during our uh, Valentine's Day cupcake baking video. Um, I think it's time for her to maybe get one, and she's giving me those puppy dog eyes, so I'm sure the time is now. Um, if this is your first time with us, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We publish new content, co new content every single Thursday. If uh, you like that video, hit that thumbs up button. Um, we've uh, had fun having you guys with us. And uh, from Ken Steep and Hippie Shake, happy training. Bye for now.